so we we gonna move off Olivia, okay? We gave her enough of our time. Cassandra, so I saw Risha's video, and she she basically put, I took it as exposing Melisandre. Uh -huh. Plenty to say, and uh, you know, goes into talking about um, the whole thing with Melisandre and how she felt used, and this, that, and the other thing. And somehow, for some reason, she ties me and Tasha into the whole thing. So, newsflash I don't even watch Vicky's channel, so I didn't even know her husband was disabled. I guess uh, maybe she didn't have enough content and she had to include right. Francois and I, like Francois and I were the only other two people that was in the group. Excuse my parents. I got out of the shower. It is almost midnight. And I had to make myself a cup of coffee. Yes, I am addressing Tasha and Frank. Before we even get started, like y'all saw in the beginning of the video, this is all for a reaction, education. I wish somebody would strike me. Yeah, because I know the laws and I know the rules. <laughs> Leon is a trip. <laughs> <laughs> Go to the store. What is wrong with you? You're messing up my video. <laughs> You're gonna hurt yourself. <laughs> Turkey. There you go. This is what you This might be a little long video. So I suggest you go get some tea, some juice, some coffee, some snacks, maybe a whole meal. If I had to, if I was able to. What? Don't get the crack. Ain't nobody saying anything about crack. Like I was saying, the tea is hot. In my case, I got coffee, you know. But it's hot. I am addressing the whole situation. I wish somebody would strike me because if you strike me, Guess what's gonna happen? I'm gonna take your whole channel. Go ahead and try. Go ahead and try me. See what happened. Try me. Um, I know a lot of people are probably not gonna be happy about this, but you know what? I could be anything and everything in the book that you wanna call me, but one thing you're not gonna say about me is that I'm a liar and I'm a fake. I'm gonna be sitting here watching the video and I'm gonna let y'all watch the video and I'm gonna stop it here and there. I can commentary and give y'all a little tea and a little proof of what, what is and what isn't. Oh, and by the way, just so y'all know, this is not a nice little, oh, I'm sorry, hi guys. No. You came for my character, therefore you gonna get all this. The hood, the ratchet, and the petty. Don't fuck with me. So, last night I was doing homework, enjoying my life, like always, and I was just like, you know what? Let me go see if Tasha and Fran are on live, because they always go live on Saturdays, and see if they addressed moi. Well, lo and behold, they did. This is exactly how I reacted. Oh, really? Oh, so you wasn't doing none of that. Okay. Oh, bitch, please. Did she say bitch? I'm gonna get them motherfuckers. I'm gonna drag all them bitches. Now, I was pissed. I was so freaking pissed. I was pissed. You want to talk about somebody being pissed? I was pissed. And then I help that it was like almost 2 o'clock in the morning. So nobody was up, nobody's around for me to say anything or talk to anything about it to calm me down. And I don't even know why I assumed <clears throat> Leon and Anna was going to help me calm me down. No, they just as bad as all these other people on YouTube with the petty shit. They was with it. They all for it. Now I have calmed down a little bit, just a tiny little bit, but not enough for me to not make this video. So I'm going to watch it. We gonna react together. And guess what? Feelings is gonna be hurt. Risha, she, I guess Risha, you know, you had to put it out there on the streets, huh? Hey, Risha. But, I mean, I, I get it. I understand. You know, um, I'm gonna be honest with you, Risha. I was a little confused when I saw your video because I thought you and Melisandre had a different type of relationship. I thought you I was a little cooler than that. But, again, I, I don't know 
Well, I kind of don't know why I thought that because I, I know you don't know her personally. I mean, you live in Virginia. She lives in Connecticut. Y'all haven't met. Um, you you know, you do like you and I do. We see each other in the comments. We see each other in the live. And I think people get associations confused with friendships. I, I think they get those confused. And I, I think that's a lot of confusion in this community of YouTube. They feel like if you're associated with somebody, then that's maybe a friend because I step into the live and I say, hey girl, how you doing girl? And I guess now we friends, you know? Um, lunch. Yeah, right. Um, we, uh, we may work together, um, you know, all that kind of stuff. Like we all know each other. Right. Right, so, um, yes, you said they felt comfortable. Yes. Um, you know, um, I, you know, I just, I, I mean, I get how you felt, Risha. You know, I, I listened to your video, and I, I get how you felt. Now, I will say this, Risha, because you said this, baby, you know you be late with the tea, huh? Because what you were talking about, they talking about they understand where Risha's coming from, but excuse me, but uh, I could have sworn somebody went to Fran about the situation that Risha was speaking on, and Fran basically just blew it off, and Risha was kind of pissed at everybody. I don't know who she really was pissed off. Was it Mel or was it Jean? I can't decide. But either way, I had no idea about the racist video. If once I finally realized what was going on. I went to go look for it and it was gone he shut it down he knew he knew he was not coming for no heat he was not ready for that heat regardless if if you just remove the word black and you just speak on women it was still disgusting and just dis disturbing and so trifling that it made no sense whatsoever but no let's continue let's continue so two three four weeks ago but that's okay, because you said you're busy, and, I, I, and you ain't even got to tell me. You got kids. I already know you're busy. You know, but I was just laughing. I was like, every time. And yes, Risha has no idea about a lot of things that's going on. Risha got her own life. She ain't worried about what's going on in these YouTube streets. All she care about is her babies. She come out with a video about something. It'd be two, three weeks ago. You know, but uh, you, you got to get it out when you can get it out, and I understand that. You know, I mean, I was glad Risha um, talked about it because she mentioned something that I mentioned in my video, which was the situation with Fabulous Moms and the day that I left that mm -hmm. Facebook group because mm -hmm. I was still conflicted because I thought, like, this was a group of content creators and I want to have some allies out here who are doing the same thing. But what I realized is that you know, sometimes you just need one person to really have as the ally. Um, you know, so you can gain more. Oh, of course. Great, but, you know, I've always known, like, if you have one good friend, you've got, you know, you've got something good. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I was relying on, that wasn't so much relying, but I was, um, I joined this Facebook group in hopes that I could meet some other people who were doing what I could do, what I was doing, and vibing, get ideas, network, things like that. All it turned out to be a bunch of them. I left. Um, my husband gets up really early um, to go to work, um, and uh, I think that morning I was up at like five, and I looked at my phone and I saw a notification that I had a tag. So it had tagged me in a comment on Gabriel's box. Well, it was. I'm not gonna even be sure at all. Okay. Video on that. And I was you like, I, you know, I no, it's not mine. You're messing up my video. See, this is the reason why I can't do no fucking videos. Really, pig? Oh my god. Leona's getting them in there. <laughs> I'm supposed to be pumped. No, get out of here. I'm supposed to be pumped and mad, and you're over here trying to mess me up. <laughs> <laughs> you and the children. <laughs> you too damn tall. This bitch. This <laughs> when bitches fuck with me. I fuck bitches up. <laughs> oh my god. 
this video is not working out the way I had it in my mind. Alright. Now back to the, <laughs> to the reaction video. Damn. Alright, Michael Channel. Reaction video. You know, guys, if you're watching me, I do, you know, short videos. Um, of course they're not your thing. You make sure you put everything on Tasha's channel because you don't want no flag. Tell me I'm lying. Stop bullshit. So I go and click on the video and it's some guy driving in some town I've never seen before and he just starts going in about black women. I literally gave the video about three minutes. It ain't on your level. It ain't on your level. Girl, please. It ain't on your level. Like, you don't be sitting up there on live every Saturday discussing shit that is on your level. Like, Continue. Uh, I think I'll chat. By the time I came back to it, there was a comment from someone else who had some screenshot from a private conversation that included Melisandre um, and Risha talked about that in her video. Um, <clears throat> I mean, they were, you know, there were two people who were talking about me, they, they mentioned Tasha, just not, you know, definitely not supporters. I'm in a group of people who are supposed to be supporters, and then here's two people talking much trash. Uh, then we can look at these, you know, one person that we would have a channel, and then the other trash talking you're in a group that's supposed to be supportive of other people but you they talking about trash again what do you do every saturday or whatever day y'all decide to go on live to do oh wait what do you do what do you do person um has a channel um, as channel, I'll just put it that way. <laughs> and, um, you know, uh, I just kind of took it for what it was worth and left it right there. I was done. You know what I mean? Since then, I have spoken to one of those two people uh, who apologized to me. The other one apologized to me in email. And I thought that I was willing to keep that going to me. I don't trust me, but... Your conscience is clear. Your conscience is clear. Oh, don't worry, guys. The, the, Leon, get out of my view. <laughs> 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 Face. Yeah, I'm leaving this shit in. I don't give a fuck. This is how this is supposed to be. Like, this is some real shit, guys. Yeah, he had that look on his face like a... <laughs> that was funny. I'm done with him. I can't stand it right now. He messing up my video. But like I was saying... <laughs> I'll expose you. Like, I'm trying to expose these other people. I'm trying to grab nipples. She's playing with her nipples. I ain't playing with her damn nipples. It's between the damn two. I'm sorry, guys. I've been trying to get to the topic oh, of this video. Video. Ew. No, See? you know. No, buy that shit out of there. We play with the nipples. Uh, you play with nipples. <laughs> oh man, he just fucked your whole video up. Damn. Uh-uh, I'm leaving this shit in. Oh no. <laughs> I can't with you. See, I <laughs> you fuck up. Damn it. Real niggas play with their nipples. They play with their damn nipples. I, <laughs> I guys, I swear to y'all, this was not planned. This is so impromptu. Like I had no idea this shit was gonna go down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? <laughs> mm -mm. Did nobody expect that damn shit? Dude. You just did with the damn look. You, you try to do it. Play. Play <laughs> I'm done. I can't stand him. I don't do that shit no more. I don't have to play. She said I don't have to 
don't do that shit no more. <laughs> when nobody's around <laughs> and it don't work <laughs> all right it took me a minute to come back but like I was saying before they got in my in this video um guilt your conscience is clear oh is your conscience clear <laughs> I'm gonna come with the receipts don't worry about it don't worry about it it's gonna be <laughs> nobody like you wasn't posting memes kiki and haha with everybody else like you wasn't going live like you wasn't posting pictures about things that you bought for dinner you wasn't feeling no vibes somebody that doesn't feel no vibes is not going to be in the group posting nothing you're not going to post nothing you're going to be lurking you're going to be a little lurker and be nosy and see what's going on but now you was a little kiki haha in the group but you didn't feel no vibe because the people in the group well I can't say the people let me just say two people peeped your bullshit that's why you didn't like the group two people pe peeped your bullshit and they called your ass out on it and then instead of you being the grown woman that you claim to be you scurried your little ass to the admins boohooing and crying talking about somebody said that somebody did a video about me da -da -da -da. girl as many videos as you've done about other people, really, really, you want to talk about what somebody else did about you, but you be running in these YouTube streets talking about everybody else and they mammy. Make it make sense. Make it make sense, people. Started seeing a lot of stuff going on, and I just decided to exit my way out because I don't, I didn't. That's why. Because people was not falling for your bullshit. You know, but. I know how to network on my own, you know, so I was, I was cool with it. Networking on your own? You mean using Olivia, Chrissy, and Jazzy in your videos? That's your way of networking? Hmm. Really? Hmm. Okay. I didn't, you know, I, I, it just seemed like it was a lot of two-facedness and back and forth and nitpicking and stuff like that, and I didn't want to be involved in that. Like, with me doing reaction videos, I get a lot of hate comments and stares and, and thumbs downs all by my 
myself. I don't need assistance from other people to get more of that nonsense. Exactly. Uh huh. Exactly. Sure. So once my name started getting drummed up and stuff, that I had no idea what was going on. Your name got drugged up because your ass wanted to go to Brandy with some bullshit that had nothing to do with you. That's why your name got drugged up into it. And Brandy, she didn't know what the fuck was going on. She thought she was just a snake just like everybody else that was in the group. Why? Huh, I wonder why. This all stems to something else that had nothing to do with none of y'all. And y'all wanted to run your fucking mouth, go skirt your ass over to network with other people when really you was just digging for tea. Say I'm lying. Oh, yeah, she's going to come up and say, I didn't do this. I didn't. Bitch, please. Bitch, please. Everybody, like you said, we all need doing reactions and sharing our opinions that everybody's thinking about. Well, I'm going to say everything that what everybody else is thinking. Because we all know it's bullshit. You know, I decided, you know what? I was, I was to me, I was more peaceful when I wasn't involved in that group. When I got involved in that group, I, I just started seeing a lot of animosity amongst people in that group. The animosity was only between you and whoever made a video about you. I didn't know y'all prior to this group, and we can just keep it like that. Like, I'm good with it, you know? Now, if, you know, somebody from the group comes to my page and leaves a comment, and I see it, I'm going to reply, because I'm just not that type of person. But, you know, she didn't reply to everybody. I, hadn't, I hadn't even talked. The only person I had talked to on the phone with was Francois. Those other people... I see them in my comments. I would see them in a live, and that was the extent of our relationship. Like that was it, but no more than that. So, um, mm -hmm. but anyway, so yeah, so Risha, we saw your video, and um, so, um, girl. So, quite frankly, I just don't want to give that whole thing any more life because that whole thing is so convoluted. It's just. I, you know, it's just so convoluted. I'm not giving it any more energy. So yeah, and just... see, and what I didn't like, Francois, is I didn't like how it was like, like it was like every time some drama was going on in that group, my name was being brought up. I'm like, wait a minute, I don't even know that. I don't even know. Your name was brought up because your ass was always in the motherfucking drama. I mean, let's be real. Every other video, no. Every video that you have is about drama on somebody else's channel. That's why your name was brought up. I mean, aren't you a reaction channel? Don't you do reaction videos? I mean, aren't you a drama channel? I mean, that's how you tag them, right? Isn't that how you tag them? These people. So why am I, I don't even talk to nobody. So why am I steady, you know... Yeah, I, I don't know what it was all about. I, me personally, you know, when people don't know about you, they try to make up things about you. And I'm not saying the women in the group did that exclusively, um, but it, it happens, well, you know. You know, this week, and I'll just go ahead and put it out there, just, you know, um, Vicky, the wife of Vicky, that I think this week, um, she had plenty to say, and, I, you know, I've never spoken with her on the phone. True. I've never chatted with her. We True. We have gone back and forth in Fabulous Moms because I guess she was offended because I said... Fabulous Mom and also the YouTube Tea Room. That's right. I'm exposing that bitch. I don't give a fuck. Your ass was in the motherfucking YouTube tea room. It was supposed to... Everybody makes it seem like it was some secret group. Oh my god, it's a secret group. It was never a fucking secret. People knew about the fucking group. People just didn't give a fuck about the group. But your ass was in that motherfucking group. You making it seem like you was only in Fab Mom, Kiki Ha, and everybody. But your ass was definitely in the motherfucking YouTube tea room. Not only did you do that... Honey, you was doing a whole bunch of other shit. And I got the receipts for that. That there was no support in that group. And for whatever reason, she decided to post a bunch of screenshots. I don't even know what the screenshot that. I did not have time to even investigate in terms of, like, hitting the freeze frame to see what they were talking about. So I guess because maybe she 
commented on a couple of our videos that's supposed to be like, you're supportive. Like, oh my god. I had nothing to do with me. I really don't give a shit, to be honest. I really didn't. I don't know why they're making it seem like it's about friendship. We were never friends. I said that already in my video. We were not friends. It's about the fact that you're claiming it's supposed to be a support group. We're not supposed to do this and that. Fran, 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 your hands are not clean in this. No, it's not. You was in that group. You was talking shit. Yes, you was. With you. Um, and maybe, maybe I shouldn't have had expectations of necessarily being supported. I don't know. But at the end of the day, she had the whole screenshot uh, that I guess we're supposed to support her assertion that she was supported and to uh, disclaim saying that I wasn't supported. Um, but at the end of the day, I'm just going to get to the punchline. I guess I'm supposed to be fake because of that. Um, maybe I'm fake because you don't know me. Maybe I'm fake because... You're fake. You want to know why you're fake? <laughs> had nothing to do with the group or you talking, lying, saying that you wasn't supportive. It really had nothing to do with that. You're fake because we all know your ass likes to run your mouth. And here's why. Remember how I, in my last video I mentioned, you know, there was this little shit going on, you know what I'm saying? Behind the scenes. <clears throat> I guess that involved Melisandra. Well, I also mentioned somebody named Contessa. And I also didn't mention another person that was involved, SB. Well, the reason why Francois didn't mention this stuff that was going on, she was involved in all that shit. She was in the group talking shit, making fun of everybody, calling people crazy, nuts, all that shit. Mm -hmm. Your hands is not clean, girl. Don't sit here and play games. We all know you're fake. You built up some type of persona of who you think I am, and then maybe now. I already knew how you was. I knew how you was the minute you commented. You think I'm something different? I don't know, but I don't know how you can pretend to even think you know someone through a screen that you don't know. I mean, I don't know how much more real I can be in the morning when I'm driving to work. Pouring my heart out, talking to you guys about what's going on. I don't have time to put on personality. And that's all you show. You don't show anything else about your life. You don't really show shit about your life. You show the shit that makes it seem like you live a picture perfect house and have a picture perfect family. When we all know that ain't fucking true. Let's be real. Just because you live in a nice house and you can afford to buy Louis Vuittons and you think you balling and you above everybody else. Bitch, everybody got fucking problems in their house. Everybody got issues in their marriage, and everybody can't fucking stand their kids. Let's be real. You know what I mean? I'm not an actress. I am a wife and a mom, and I'm a mother. And I'm not going to sit here and pretend that I know everybody. Like, I'm not going to sit here and pretend that I know everybody. Like, I'm not going to sit here and pretend that I know everybody. Like, I'm not going to sit here and pretend that I know but if someone wants to think that I'm... Oh, they don't have time to put on the show. Oh, really? Because you was definitely making the show. You was definitely putting on the show. Because SB reached out to you and asked you questions about what was going on. If you knew anything that was going on. And you kind of had a snippy-ass attitude in return. I mean, I wonder why. Oh, that's right. You didn't want no, no parts of it. You didn't want nothing to do with any of this because you knew your hands was dirty involved in all this shit that was going down with Melisandre. Leon's getting my nerves, guys. Come get his ass. He need to, he need to go. But yeah, that's the real reason why I don't fuck with Mel. Because she lied on me and said that I, I did this and I did that. Bitch, no, I didn't. I don't have a reason to lie. Like I said, you can call me whatever you want in the book, but one thing you cannot call me is a liar and a fake. I done showed y'all every fucking thing in my life. I showed y'all I lived in a fucking hotel. I showed y'all I lived on the fucking floor in my mother-in-law's house. I showed y'all all the gritty, gritty bullshit. And now that I'm trying to move my life outside of that bullshit, I'm not with the. I'm not with it. So 
you gonna sit here and claim that I'm a liar or I'm this or I'm that? No, we're not gonna be doing that. Nobody's gonna sit here and think that I'm just some timid, shy little person. Just because I don't speak on a lot of things doesn't mean that I don't peep a lot of shit. The reason why I don't fuck with Tasha and Fran is because both of y'all is some fake motherfucking bitches. Yes, I said it. Y'all wanna sit here and get mad about Nisi getting a thousand subscribers because she's talking about Olivia? How the fuck did y'all get your channel? Explain that shit to me. Explain it. Explain exactly how y'all get your channel. Huh? 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 You want to get mad about other people making reaction videos about you or talking about y'all, but y'all do it to everybody else. You do it to every single body else. You want to sit up here and talk about, oh, I, I was expecting support and all this other stuff. I don't have nothing against these women. I don't have no problem with these women. You know, I just, I just see myself as the mother figure and just offering advice. Nobody gives a fuck. Nobody cares. Nobody gives a shit about your opinion. You want to sit here up here and talk about your content creator. At least one thing about Olivia... Jazz and Chrissy, they have their own content. They ain't got to talk about nobody. Nobody. And then you got all these other people over here ch talking about these girls just for they, they can get a come up. Get the fuck out of here. I kept my mouth shut about a lot of this shit that was going on the past couple fucking months because I felt like I wasn't in a p position to say anything. But I'm done with the bullshit. I'm way past the bullshit. I'm in pissed. Nobody, nobody is going to sit up here and talk about and justify the fact that they're just offering their opinion or they just doing a reaction video when you're sitting up here talking about somebody what somebody should and shouldn't do with their fucking life these girls are under 30 years old we are not in a position to tell them what they should and shouldn't do with their lives you how would you feel if somebody told you you shouldn't be doing this you shouldn't be doing that somebody be like well i'm not doing what they're doing no but you're obviously doing something that you wouldn't want nobody else to know am i lying Am I lying? Everybody got shit in their, in their closet. Everybody got shit in their closet that you would not want nobody to know about. So don't sit up here and play that you fucking some Jehovah Witness and you, you Jesus and all this other shit. Let's not, no, let's not play these games. I'm not the fucking one. Shall we continue? There's no substance. There was no substance, honey. You, you just there was no substance. I hope this video gives you substance. The fuck? What kind of substance was you looking for? Hmm. Which was what was you looking for? You want this is what she was looking for. You was looking for the real hot tea. That's what she was looking for. And this is what you're gonna get. The video was about all three of y'all motherfuckers who be sitting up here lying, bullshit, talking about, oh, I'm for everybody. I love my supporters. I'm this, I'm that. But yet you look at everybody down with your nose like this. You look good to everybody. That's what y'all be doing. That's what y'all be doing. It was about all y'all. It had nothing to do with no fucking friendships. It was about how y'all be bullying, bashing, and degrading a whole bunch of fucking women that you claim that you support and you look up to or you, you, you hoping the best for them. No, it's not. That's not what that is. That's not what women empowerment is. You don't sit up here and talk about people. And that's what all three of y'all do. And along with the whole bunch of other people that I don't feel the need to even mention. Because all they're doing is following after y'all three. If you want to be a content creator and take it seriously to make this into a business, I suggest you come up with your own content. And make sure you don't have no cursing. You don't talk about drama. You don't do a whole lot of shit that, you know, AT&T, Nestle and all that. And if you don't give a fuck about being sponsored or making YouTube a big, big, big deal, then don't expect to get the fucking following. Because YouTube is not going to market your shit. YouTube does not give a fuck about you. You want to sit here and talk about, I'm not, I got a job. I don't need to get paid for this. Then why the fuck you here? Huh? Why the fuck you here? If you don't want, if you're not trying to get paid, why are you here? You're not, you're not educating nobody on anything. You're not talking about nothing with sub substance. The fuck you here for? Huh? I'm waiting. I can see if he was offering some type of expertise, but you ain't got shit to offer. I know everybody. Everybody. Come on now. Tell me, 
tell me y'all don't think like this. I like I think. Come on now. Every time y'all see Tasha, y'all be thinking that she's gonna start doing this. Oh, Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. And then when you think about Fran, you just automatically think about that ditzy woman that was the mom of the twins on Sister Sister. And they need some help. Uh, what kind of pains are uh, this kind? How? <laughs> Come on now. Don't tell me y'all don't think that. Come on now. Come on. Tell me. Tell me. Everybody's thinking the same thing. I know everybody on Lipstick Alley is thinking the same thing. I know Blah Mom and all them, all them other people is thinking the same thing. Everybody is thinking the same thing. And you want to sit here and talk about what I'm saying the same thing everybody else is saying about Chrissy, Jazz, and Olivia. Well, everybody's thinking the same thing about y'all. And you want to get butt hurt because I said something about y'all? If, you don't, if I'm a non-factor, then why even mention me? If I'm not that important to you, why even mention me? If you don't watch my videos all like that, which you lied because you commented on my videos, you mentioned my video. I saw a video the other day. First of all, I don't know if you saw this video, but um, a YouTuber uh, did a video on um, channels that are underrated. And I was oh. like, oh, okay. Um... So, yeah, I saw that video. And that's all I got to say about that. You know, I mean, I have a lot of channels that I watch that I'm kind of like, gosh, I, I wish I could share these with some of my YouTube friends. Um, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Mm -hmm. Let me know. Let me know. I'm, I'm talking about all sides. So, Blama, to answer your question, if you have not seen that video, go watch it. Um, oh. She opened the video talking about, uh, with a, a voice recording of Nell Sandra talking about uh, that was on YouTube and how it got shit. And she's not friends with any of the people there. And she's only there just to kind of, I guess, have a window in with the people. Whatever, I'm paraphrasing, but you can go watch it yourself. If it's still up, uh, um, Anyway, uh, she goes into talking about um, the whole thing with Melisandre and how she felt used and this, that, and the other thing. And somehow, for some reason, she ties me and Tasha into the whole thing. And then she also talks about um, some person, a mom of 12, who's another person who decided to do another video about... I never mentioned a mom of 12. Can we replay that? Tasha, who first of all, can I interrupt you for a moment? Yeah. So, I, I and I noticed that I don't know how y'all's relationship is, but y'all be shading the fuck out of each other, and I be enjoying it, and I know everybody else do too, and we just waiting, we just waiting for the moment that y'all fell out because that shit's gonna be funny as fuck. I mean, I don't know how y'all are, because, you know, everybody ain't like me, you know? Not everybody like me, not everybody like Melisandre, not everybody like everybody else, you know what I'm saying? Not everybody's all for the tea and dropping the bombs and exposing people, but I'll just be, I'll be seeing it. I'm just saying, you might want to find new friends. I had did a video, I don't know, a couple weeks ago, where I was talking about, I feel like, you know. Oh, here it is. Mm -hmm. I've mm -hmm. been seeing a lot of on YouTube. I have people shouldn't put their financial business out there. And I made reference to, like, you know how when people go do grocery hauls and they put food stamp haul or whatever, you know. So I guess me saying that, and I also made a reference to, I was like, I said, even if your man or your husband or whatever is disabled, like, in law, unless he's in a coma or he's, you know. Can we replay back that video? Working. I don't care if he got some type of physical ailment unless he laid up in the bed on a stretcher there's something he can do right there's something he can do to to make ends meet especially if y'all got kids so when you get on so then you then people these youtubers they get on here they put all their personal business out here on youtube and then they try to figure out why people in the comments asking so many questions or being extremely judgmental towards them. Now they're trying to figure out why that's happening. Well, why do you think that's happening? Because you you got a whole man living in your house and you got splashed across the stream that you're going to go uh, to the store with some food stamps. 
or you telling people, oh, I gotta, uh, I gotta go recertify for my food stamps. Oh, I see in the coma. I think you need to watch how you word things sometimes, Tasha. It don't look good. It really don't look good. So I guess her husband is disabled. I didn't know that. So I guess she assumed I was talking about her. So, newsflash, I don't even watch Vicky's channel. Newsflash, yes you do. Ladies, all I gotta say is, don't say shit if you can't back it up. Or, don't say shit and you know it's on the internet for everybody to say. So, I didn't even know her husband was disabled. No, I didn't know that. You know, so she just assumed that I would talk about her. I didn't assume. The information that I said in the video related to her, but it probably related... It was about her. It was about me. Everybody knew it was about me. Come on. Come on. And oh yeah, by the way, that video that you mentioned about, oh, well, you shouldn't get upset about, it was a clickbait video. Nobody in the comments was disgusting or rude or ignorant in my comments. Actually, I was talking to my new subscribers who had questions and concerns and advice and suggestions. If you would have watched the video, you would have known. But I wasn't, I wasn't ivory. I wasn't ivory. If you remember, my, my thumbnail was like this. And that was at the end of the video when I said like, comment, and subscribe. Like that Resume. video has well over 2,000 views on it. probably related to a lot of people. But she decided to go on my channel and left a comment. I didn't leave a comment. I cussed the fuck at her. I went off. And I was like, okay, girl. So, um, why does that make people day have to tell someone how you don't like that? Like, well, you know, I mean, I said it because I wanted to. Same way y'all say what you want to say about everybody else because you wanted to. Y'all be contradicting yourself a lot. Whew. Maybe it made her feel, feel better. I, I, I guess it made her feel better. But this is gonna make me feel better. Yeah, I don't care if you don't like me. You don't care. Don't she sound like Medea sometimes? She sound like Medea, and then sometimes I be thinking like she gonna be like this with her voice. All my life I had to fight. I love Harpo, but I kill him dead before I let him beat me. Is me? Is it just me? Is it just me? Just let me know. Just let me know. Is it just me? Am I the only one? You don't have the energy? Really? You don't have the energy. Can we bring back the other screenshot that you think people are crazy and nuts? Okay. I give zero F's. You know, no pun intended. I give zero <laughs> So basically, what, what the only thing that, I mean, her, like, like Francois said, her video was represent Melisandre. And you. I guess and didn't her. have enough content and she had to include right. Francois and I, like Francois. Oh, I have plenty of content. But unlike y'all two, I work in HR and I live in Charlotte, California. Okay. Unlike you, I go to school and I have a fucking job. That don't mean shit. But YouTube is not my fucking life. Y'all don't send me up here uploading every single day, coming up with fake ass fucking content just to put up on YouTube or discussing other people just to get views. And I was the only other two people that was in the group. Um, I didn't know Vicky and I had issues because other than... Oh, we didn't have issues until this live. Now we got a motherfucking problem. My comments and a chat room only time I had now she said in the video that she talked to Melisandre daily. Right, so then wait a minute, it turns out she she talked about Mel uh, she said she talked to Melisandre daily on the phone. I've never I don't even know other than that video, I don't know what her voice sounds like on yeah. the phone. Because so I've never she talked to her on the phone. Her time, she, she, gave, she, she chose to click on your video, she chose to click on my video and gave me a like. I used her. Right. I posted a video, you subscribed to my channel, you gave me a like, now I used you. Bitch, please. Right. Yeah. Bitch, please. Remember. Remember. We all know. I know I'm not the only one that thinks like this, but I'm only going to speak for myself. Fran, you was in the group, the YouTube secret group. You was in the little secret group with all the rest of us. 
Yeah, you was. Yeah, you was. You can't deny it. You was in the group. Tasha was in the Fab, Fab Mom group. They both was in that group. But you know what? Tasha was in that group because she thought she was going to get some tea. She thought she was going to get some, some good, good, good stuff. And when she realized ain't nobody fucking with her and her bullshit and saw her damn game that she was playing, she got mad. Fran, she realized she ain't fucking with nobody. Especially after she got that little screenshot, I guess, about somebody saying whatever she wanted, they wanted to say about her. I don't, what, what are you upset about? Because somebody said that you was annoying and your neck is too fat? My neck is fucking fat. And you are annoying, Fran. I'm sorry to say. You're annoying and you're boring. You're boring. Your videos are boring. Both of y'all is motherfucking boring. I'm done, guys. I'm done. Oh, uh, I'm done. I'm done. I'm gonna go take my ass to bed. I'm gonna edit this video and get it uploaded for y'all. But look, I, I digress. I apologize and I digress. And I hope all y'all have a great week. And these girls, they were just seeking help. That's all they were doing. They were only, they were going around to everybody asking for help. Same with a few other people that. I really don't think I needed to um, explain because too many people have gotten dragged into that bullshit and it's just, it's just done with. Everybody is tired of the bullshit. Nobody wants to talk about it. Everybody's done. We, everybody's done. Like, we're not going to talk about it no more. I'm not going to sit here and act like I'm innocent or anybody else is innocent in this. We all had a role to play in this. But I'm not going to sit here and pretend. However, things have been amended. People have said their piece. People are ready to move on. And that's it. Let it go. Move on. And let it go. I said what I said. I meant what I meant. There's nothing else for me to talk about. What are you confused about? Ain't no assumptions over here. Everybody see it. We see right through the bullshit. At the end of the day, Mel used everybody. Tasha was using the group. Uh, What's her name? Damn. Her name, Fran. She she was using everybody in the group. I mean, so it just looks like you know some people are not as honest as they should be. So yeah, everybody everybody was being used. Everybody was being played with. Everybody was a pawn in the game, and everybody has some dirty secrets. So, what are your thoughts? Uh, I'll see you on the next video.